Bud Light. What's up? Yeah, if I suck at that. So anyway, <laughs> what do we got here? So this is a, a vintage 1987 neon beer sign from Budweiser. It's the Spuds McKenzie Bud Light. Spuds McKenzie, the original party animal. <laughs> <laughs> I'm at the pawn shop today to sell my vintage 1987 Bud Light Spuds McKenzie neon beer sign. It's probably one of the coolest things to have in your man cave. This is the holy grail of neon beer signs. I really want $25,000 for it. It's a super cool sign. Spuds McKinsey, like one of the greatest advertising campaigns ever. His first appearance was in 87 in the Super Bowl. This advertising campaign was astronomical. There was stuffed animals, there was t-shirts, there was socks, there was everything. Spuds McKinsey. They increased beer sales by 20% in one year with this ad campaign. And yeah, this was made by Everbright, right? Yeah. Yeah. They started making neon signs in the 1920s, and they were relatively inexpensive to produce. I mean, these things were less than $150 back then. It worked well for both sides, and they were just giving them out to every single bar, because when you're in a bar and you see a neon sign for a beer there, you know they serve that. Can I plug it in? Absolutely. There we go. Okay. All right, the big question. How much you want for it? I want 25000 for it. Where in the world did you come up with that number? That's, that's what I think it's worth. I'd be willing to go 100 bucks on it. 100 bucks? What are you, nuts? I could buy an 87 Spuds McKinsey online right now for 200 bucks. New in the box? Yeah. Spuds? He was everywhere. There's a gazillion of these out there. Every bar in the country had one. That's true. That's true, but I think it's worth more than 100. Yeah, well, no, they're worth like 200. <laughs> I'll buy it off you for 100 and I'll sell it for 200. Nah, that's not gonna work for me. I'm sorry. All right, well, have a good one. Change your mind. Come back in. Okay. Thank you. And shouldn't his name have been Suds, not Spuds? I mean, it's a potato. 